Right now on 12 News at 6, Arizona is reopening for business. The state's daily numbers of coronavirus cases continue to rise because more tests are being completed. Good evening, everyone. Thanks so much for joining us. I'm Cariba Devine. I'm Mark Curtis. More than 12,000 new tests were reported today. As President Trump is now ordering that everyone at long-term care facilities gets tested. It's a tall order, but something that needs to be done. Team Charles Bram Resnick joins us now with the details of how that will look in Arizona. Bram? There's wide agreement on one thing. This testing is months overdue and it will be a very big lift. My mother is a gift. My mother is 97, very healthy, and I want it to stay that way. So with a pandemic unfolding around them, Jeannie Tucker moved her mom Frances out of assisted living and into a king-size bed they share at Tucker's home. Even though I'm exhausted at night, I look over, I kiss her cheek, and I feel like, you know, this is where I need to be. One of Jeannie Tucker's fears, no one was being tested for COVID-19. Now, more than three months into the pandemic, the White House is urging states to test all long-term care home residents and their staffs for the coronavirus. I have been just dying because this wasn't happening early on. It needed to happen from the very beginning. COVID-19's impact on long-term care homes is staggering. In Maricopa County, 135 of roughly 500 facilities have reported at least one case. 170 residents and two staff members have died. Overall, long-term care homes account for seven of every 10 coronavirus deaths in the county. And the truth is, like, there is no way to be totally ready for what happens next. Dr. Tyler Southwell's Protect AZ has done or delivered COVID-19 testing where it's needed most. Care homes, homeless shelters, the Navajo Nation. But testing all care homes is an immense task. These facilities have a lot of camaraderie, but they don't have, they weren't created to deal with a catastrophe like this. And they need support. Governor Doug Ducey spokesman says the governor announced our goal to test everyone in long-term care facilities last week. We are actively working toward an effort to test all residents and staff. More details to come. Families hoping testing will let them visit loved ones in lockdown care homes might have to wait a while. The hope we can take is that we're going to be doing everything we can to protect them. And I feel like that is worth a ton. In Phoenix, Bram Resnick, 12 News.